Prince William arrives at Wembley to attend the FA Cup final between Manchester City and Manchester United. The Prince of Wales, who is chairman of the Football Association, arrived at Wembley for the FA Cup final today. Hello viewers, welcome to Royal Unlock. Please make sure to subscribe and hit the notifications bell, so you don't miss any updates about the British monarchy. Prince William arrived at Wembley Stadium in London to attend the FA Cup final between Manchester City and Manchester United. Today's match will see City take on United with the chance to become the first English team to win the Premier League and FA Cup double in a row. Last year, City won 2-1 at Wembley. The Prince of Wales, who is president of the Football Association, smiled when he entered the field to greet the players of Manchester United and Manchester City, as well as the managers of the two teams, before the final match. He then sat in the royal box and was joined by his eldest son, Prince George, shortly before kick-off. William, who is also a keen Aston Villa fan, will also present the trophy to the winners. Father and son, both ardent Aston Villa fans, melted their hearts in April when they watched Aston Villa play Lille in the first leg of their Europa League quarter-final. The ten-year-old wore a Villa-branded scarf as the pair clapped and smiled as their team claimed a 2-1 win. William was seen clapping, after the opening goal against Lille before turning to talk to his son. Today's appearance comes as Buckingham Palace announced this week that the royal family is set to postpone any future engagements which may appear to distract or divert attention from the election campaign after Rishi Sunak called a snap general election on July 4. A palace spokesman said, following the Prime Minister's statement this afternoon calling for a general election, the royal family will, in accordance with normal procedure, postpone engagements that may appear to distract or divert attention from the election campaign. However, despite the latest news, trooping the colour celebrations will continue next month with King Charles in attendance.